Hey everybody, the Patch and Switch Consultancy back again with the last and final piece to the unofficial end user guide to Microsoft Ignite. We have a friend. We have a very special friend for this last episode. Correct. She's a little bit of a behind the scenes woman, but uh, we have managed to track down and get onto the very busy schedule of none other than senior executive producer, Angela King. Join us today here in studio remotely via Hi. Microsoft Teams. Welcome. Thank Welcome you. to the show. I am so excited to be here. I finally get to do the fun part. <laughs> now, you, you haven't told your boss and your management chain that you're on the unofficial end user guide, right? That's they don't right. know this. Okay, Not perfect. Yet. This so. will be a surprise to share with them later today. <laughs> well, the good thing is that, you know, maybe they don't watch it, so they'll never even know. Any of our fans will notice here. <laughs> I don't know. You guys are pretty famous on our team. <laughs> now, not everybody knows that Angela, I probably shouldn't say this, she's our inside source. This is how we get all of the amazing information that we can bring to you. But Angela, I've got a comment. You've got quite the background. Yes. Yeah, I do. Uh, this is part of our Microsoft Ignite digital swag. Once you're registered, you can actually download backgrounds like this, buzzword bingo, kids activity packs, and all kinds of fun stuff um, on our digital swag link in the FAQ. So, but okay, okay. You, backgrounds are awesome, but you just mentioned buzzword bingo. Yeah, like, I did. Seriously, buzzword bingo is part of this. What's going on? Yeah, it is. I think that you'll see a lot of words that you'll be hearing about throughout the forty-eight <laughs> hours. I think some digital transformation, tech intensity. Oh. I'm sure there's some Azure Stack this, and other fun things that you guys. It's got to be, be the word empower just for Thomas Mauer. <laughs> I think that's the center cube, right? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> that is fantastic. And of course, we did mention the coloring books because that's how we keep Rick busy in the green room in, hey. in between live segments. Hey. <laughs> Just because I like the color outside the lines. <laughs> <laughs> Angela, what are you looking forward to most with the Digital Ignite experience? Yeah, I think there's a couple of things. Um, you know, first, normally we go really, really deep into uh, technical content, um, but I'm actually pretty excited to bring in the Intro to Tech Skills sessions this year. Um, these sessions go over the fundamentals, and they're for everybody who's thinking about a career in tech. Um, and I was just uh, joking around, but my dad, is. this is the first tech event he's actually joining and getting to be a part of. So I'm really wow. proud of that. So those are the technical learning skills that are part of the learning zone. Yes. Uh, which is off of the main page when you go to myignite.microsoft.com once you've registered. Okay. You'll be able to go off and see that. Um, I'm happy to say that I actually managed to sneak my team into making one of those sessions Amazing. specifically for IT pros and operations folks that are new to the, uh, new to the world. So um, there's going to be some interesting sessions in there. But as you mentioned, uh, cloud skills, what, are, what is cloud, uh, basics okay. of IT, basics of AI, a whole bunch of really interesting stuff. I think there's over 30 different sessions geared okay. specifically for that kind of uh, uh, learning group of individuals. Yeah, exactly. And on a personal note, as a parent of an elementary student with ADHD, I'm most excited about the at-home learning session that's going to be presented by our Microsoft education team. It showcases some of the accessible free tools for students that struggle with reading, writing, and math. Um, I had a preview of this session a couple of weeks ago, and it's definitely one not to miss. Very cool. What else have you added to your schedule? Because I assume you've gone through <laughs> the whole schedule builder, right? You've added everything. Yes. You've got 48 straight hours of content. I do, and probably more, because I'll get to watch actually all the sessions happening live in the back end. So <laughs> I'll be watching hundreds and hundreds of sessions at a time. <laughs> uh, but the one that I did actually add as well to my session schedule um, is the Breathe and Restore with Aditi Shah from Peloton. Um, this is a, a hosted <laughs> session by our featured partner, Intel. I'm kind of fangirling out. Um, <laughs> he is amazing. And who doesn't need to pause, refresh your mind, release all that stress? I'm definitely saving this one to my backpack to play over and over again. <laughs> That's, That's really fantastic. Cool. I was about to say, I don't know if I, you know, I'm going to be trying to make some space in the green room that I'll be able to do some yoga and stuff like that. But Joey's asked for a separate green room for some reason um, so that uh, he has his own personal space. <laughs> it's actually so that I don't have to watch him doing yoga. Um, but anyway, Angela, I also understand that you're coming to us with some news that we have not yet talked about in terms of day one in the schedule. Talk about that. So breaking news. 
Satya will be starting at 8.15 a.m. So log on early. You don't want to miss any of his key segment on building digital resilience. I was just going to say that the 8.15 particularly comes into play because I know that with the schedule, with the schedule, schedule builder, you're <laughs> able to go in and to drop down an ICS file to go inside of your Outlook calendar. If you just add it to your schedule and you use the, the My Events you know, flyout calendar to kind of keep track of things, that's already updated. But if you actually got the ICS file to throw inside your personal calendar, that's where it would still have the wrong time on that. So actually, really good catch. Thanks for, thanks for sharing that one. Yes, definitely go and delete that and then re-add that to your calendar. Sweet. Awesome. Angela, any last minute bits, any last minute tips and tricks that you have for our friends who are just days away from this event? <laughs> I would say wear your comfy pants, surround yourself with snacks, drink lots of water, and just get settled in for 48 hours. This is going to be the best of Microsoft. I've got my bag of mains. <laughs> <laughs> hey, and remember, if you want to experience all that Digital Microsoft Ignite has to offer, you need to be registered. So head on over to myignite.microsoft.com, get registered, and then immediately after that, go fill out your profile, put all those sessions in the session scheduler, and we cannot wait to share all of this amazing stuff with you at Microsoft Ignite.